my approach is going to be very short and I'm going to explain to you why also. Uh, but yeah, first let's do what we decided in the previous section of data exploration. So what we said last time was that we're going to get rid of all the negative values and also the zeros. And we're also going to get rid of everything that is lower than 200. So let me quickly do that here. We already seen that we're not losing a lot of data points when we do that. We made sure that that wasn't the case, but I just want to still see and make sure that, you know, I didn't do anything wrong. So here is the total amount of data points that we have. And here is what we have after we filter the negative values and the very high values. That's not a lot of data points missing. I think that's totally acceptable. Um, after I do that, the next thing that I normally do in data cleaning, uh, just to make sure that I'm not missing anything is the missing values. So this little comment or this little um, line of code will give us all the missing values or like the amount of missing values for each feature. And as we can see, uh, there are no missing values. That's awesome. Uh, so yeah, this is how we, or how I clean the data for the specific project. Um, but yeah, there is still something I want to tell you about it. Data exploration, data cleaning, data preparation, these are all actually very, very highly interconnected. You cannot just say, I'm done with data cleaning, you know, because of course we're looking at outliers, we're looking at missing values, but sometimes there are things that we don't really figure out until we actually go into the data preparation phase. So basically just keep in mind that we will still be filtering our data uh, when necessary. We'll still be looking into uh, or keeping our, our, keeping our eyes open for problems. So yeah, we're gonna deal with problems as they uh, come into our way. But for now, you know, the mo we checked the most common things and we dealt with them and there are no other problems. And uh, that means we can go into data preparation.